how old is Islam and what was before Islam? If only Islam is the truth, then how come there are Hindu evidences four to seven thousand years old? Brother Amit, I know that most of the non-Muslims have a misconception and some of the Muslims also that Islam came into existence after the birth of Prophet Muhammad and Islam is about 1400 years old. This is a misconception. Islam is there since time immemorial. And the first prophet of Islam was not Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him, it was Prophet Adam peace be upon him. And Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him is the last and final messenger. And Quran is not the first revelation of Islam, it is the last and final revelation of Islam. So question, when, how old is Islam? Islam is there since time immemorial. Since time immemorial. Since man set foot on the earth. The first human being was Adam peace be upon him. Since that time Islam is there. So the second part of the question, how come there is evidence of Hinduism four to seven thousand years before? I agree. There are some evidences of Hindu scriptures and there are some evidences. But that doesn't mean that Hinduism is older than Islam. Islam is much older. Anyhow, a religion becoming old does not give more authenticity. The authenticity is on the scripture itself. It is not based on if it's new, it is more authentic or if it's old, it's more authentic. The authenticity is depending upon the truth. So if you analyze the Quran, as, as Quran says, there were several revelations sent on the face of the earth. By name, only four are mentioned. The Torah, the Zabur, the Injil, and the Quran. And there were 124,000 messengers sent on the face of the earth. By name, only 25 are mentioned in the Quran. Adam, Noah, Abraham, Moses, Jesus, Muhammad, peace be upon them all. So what we have to realize is that if you study the scripture, and you do comparative study, which you can see my talks on it, similarity between Islam and Christianity, similarity between Islam and Hinduism. And if you put the test of time, when we put the test of time, the Quran is a miracle of miracles. Previously, it was the age of miracles. And Quran is the miracle of miracle. Then came the age of literature and poetry. When the Quran was revealed, it was the age of literature and poetry. And Arabic was at its pinnacle, what was its best. And when the Arabs, when they heard the Quran being recited, when they read the Quran, they said, this cannot be a human handiwork. No human being can write such beautiful Arabic. And many accepted Islam. So Arab Quran is the best Arabic literature on the face of the earth. So that time was the age of literature and poetry. Quran proved itself. Today, if a religious book says in a very poetic fashion, the world is flat, will a modern man believe? In it? And the answer is no. Today is the age of science and technology. So today if you put the test of science to the religious scriptures available, only Alhamdulillah Quran passes the test. If you put the test of science to Quran, I've given a talk on Quran and modern science, compatible or incompatible. And there you come to know that there is not a single verse in the glorious Quran which is against established science. And there are more than 6,000 verses in the Quran, out of which more than a thousand speak about science. So if you put this test, you will come to know that Quran is the most authentic scripture. And if you do analysis, then you come to know which religion is most authentic. All the other scriptures that were sent before the Quran, by the passage of time, they changed. And since they were not to be, follow, to be followed till eternity, all the messengers that came before Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, they were sent only for their people and that time. All the scriptures that were revealed before the Quran were only meant for those people and that time. That is the reason Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala didn't feel it a requirement to preserve it in the authentic form. But the Quran is the last and final revelation. And Allah says in the Quran, Surah Hijr, chapter number 15, verse number 9, that we have revealed the Quran and we shall guard it from corruption.